back to winning ways, Stuart, is that what we were looking for? Yeah, obviously we needed to win tonight. Um, nice to have a clean sheet. Second half, I thought at times we got a little bit sloppy, but um, three really good goals. Um, and nice to score. That's the eighth game we've had here this season, the first time we've gone ahead. So, you know, that was important. And, uh, you know, I thought we started with a lot of confidence and good passing. And as I said, scored three terrific goals. We do lack a bit of aerial height for set players. I know they're a big side and you know they've had a couple of chances with them and it's you know that's the nature of the beast when we haven't got a, a huge side. But um, yeah, all in all, um, decent. Thought we could have been better second half without a doubt, but you know it's a result we needed. A lot has been made about uh, starting quickly. You just touched on a little bit there. Obviously, coming up in five minutes and three 0 at half time, it couldn't have gone much better in that mm-hmm. sense, really. Yeah, exactly. Um, and three midfielders scoring. You know, we, we were talking yesterday about everyone having to chip in. It's not just the strikers; everyone's got to chip in. Um, you know, first goal, it's a you know, good pitch lands on the second ball. Um, Clarky, good ball into Cookie, has a good touch, swivels, and a good finish. He's been desperate for a goal. He's been close so many times. I said yesterday he could have had four or five already this season. Thankfully, got that one. Takes a little bit of pressure off. Um, and then the second one's a terrific goal. Great ball by Clark at Clare and back into Elliot's path and a, a, a beautiful strike. You know, they've had then they came with a back five, which I thought would take a little bit of breaking down. Um, but thankfully we did it early and it's so important to get that early goal and then they change the formation and come on to us a little bit more. Um, and the third goal's a, a great free kick and what we work on, you know, Pritch getting in there and nice little header. It's all about delivery. Um, good run, but the timing of the the timing of the run, the really good delivery from Clark. Another thing you touched on yesterday was being clinical. We obviously mm. saw that in the first half going forward, but going back as well, the clean sheet, I suppose, that, that's shown how clinical we were in the defensive phase as well. Yeah, I think the seven, who was on loan from Arsenal, is a good player for them. Um, he broke away first half and just put it wide of the post. We had a little um, little bit of fortune there. And a couple, just before half-time, a set play. Um, as I said, they, they were always going to be dominant in that area. Um, but other than that, I thought the two O'Connors were outstanding tonight, um, allied with some other good performances as well. You spoke about the second half, maybe wanting a little bit more going forward as well. Has that given us obviously something to build on going forward? We saw a good performance in the first half, but yeah, to improve. Yeah, definitely. So we knew they'd come out 3 0 down, you've got nothing to lose. They're a young side, um, you know, play without any fear, really. We've had a couple of opportunities. Clayton's had one on the sort of yeah, and Pritch and Clark have had two good chances and pulled them wide. We talk about the importance of hitting the target. Um, and we've not worked the goalkeeper. But listen, overall, it was it, it was a result we needed. Um, people would have expected us to win tonight when you look at Southend's form. Um, but we, we went out and did a, a reasonable job.